Man, oh day, are we going to have fun in today's video. Today, I am going to be looking at Studio One Pro version 7's super cool new feature of separating stems. It's going to be awesome. I'm excited to check this out. I have been a Studio One user since 2017 consistently, and I love that DAW for so many reasons. There have been so many music projects that I have produced and, and mixed and mastered through Persona Studio One and done a lot of composition and sample library work as well. Um, all of my voice acting work has been done with this software, and it has been a staple in my professional career. So today we are going to attempt separating the stems of a Will It Riff that I did with my band Small Town Titans, which is the videos with the barcodes and you try to get a guitar tab that's somewhat decent out of those barcodes like this here. Will it riff? Will it riff? Will it riff? You've probably seen those things floating around. Well, yeah, that's me and my band. And uh, we self-produce those and mix and master everything within house. And uh, so I have the master file queued up here. I'm gonna bring this to everyone's attention here. There we go. And let's see if it works. Yeah, there we go. Hi. The amount of views that this thing got is just ridiculous. All right, so you get the idea. That's the that's the master track of Heinz right there. So now, what we are going to do is we are going to right click. We are going to go to audio and we are going to separate the stems. I have no idea how this is going to go. We're going to, I mean, look at this thing. We're going to see that there's four selections. There's vocals, drums, bass, and other. Uh, and it looks like it says consolidate selected stems are bounced to new track. It doesn't look like that's uh, selectable right now. So we're going to give this a shot and see what happens. Click OK. Hopefully my computer doesn't crash. OK, there we go. All right. All right. Let's take it. No, it's not taking too long all right sweet seven five three one <laughs> is this the vocal Heinz. oh what that's amazing Heinz. okay there's a little bit of uh uh lot lot loss of detail though but that's okay That's pretty good on, on the vocal front there. All right, Personas. Yeah, yeah, I approve of that. Let's take a listen to uh, the drums. See if this is accurate. That's, that's really good. There's a, there's a little bit, okay. There's a, just a tiny bit of digital fragmentation there, but it's not it's not too noticeable. I could see how this tool could be amazing for for karaoke or for practicing or just, you know, if, if you're in a pinch as a producer and need to separate stuff, this could be really incredibly useful. All right, let's take a listen to the bass. There it is. Wow. You could <laughs> that was such a sloppy take. <laughs> As if I mean, yeah, say what you will. I'm I am a proficient bass player. I am not a master bass player. I have so much uh room for improvement in that regard. My 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 focus is vocals, but um it is what it is. Anyway, let's listen. Let's see how it did with the guitar stem. Okay. That's still really good. All right. Yeah, that's... There's a little bit... You can hear some of the digital uh, fragments in there, but other, the, other than... That's a really cool feature. All right, let's listen to the entire thing together. This is not the master file. This is the uh, stems. Heinz. Wow. Heinz. Heinz. 
dance. That's really good. That's like really good. All right, I'm gonna try to switch back and forth between the two. All right, so there, this is the original. This is the original. Personas. Yeah, did yourself this time. This is a huge, this is a major leap right here. And as a Personas user, I am absolutely thrilled that I don't have to use third party um, software to do this anymore. I can do it right in house with Persona Studio 7. This is an excellent tool and I love doing practice with my, my own work karaoke, being able to do that stuff and post it for people. Um, that's just, that's going to be, this is going to be so great for instructional purposes, for my voice students and um, for performance purposes and practice purposes. There's just, there's just a whole slew of possibilities here um, for, for anyone who is a singer, a, a voice instructor or a producer and composer for that matter. And, um, a voice actor as well. There's just a, a lot of applications here, and the, the it's so amazing to hear. Like once everything is put together, the digital fragmenting is, it, it it diminishes quite a bit um, when you put all the stems together. So that's that's really phenomenal um, work on Personas's part. Way to go! Kudos, 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 kudos. I would give this. If I had to rate this, I would give this feature a 9 out of 10. Um, the only reason being is that there is like there's that slight digital fragmentation when you solo out um, some of the uh, some of the stems here. But um, I'm really, really impressed with how it it uh, it how it got the drums. That the drum stem sounds really good. And once you put everything together, you can't hear the digital fragmentation very much at all. So. Um, Overall, very happy with this feature, and uh, yeah. By the way, I think it's worth saying, I am not being paid by Personas to make this video. I am simply presenting this as a as a, a dedicated and devout user of this DAW, and uh, am, am just super happy to see this, uh, this feature being included within the updated version of Studio One. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. My name is Philip Nathaniel Freeman. I'll see you in the next video. Peace!